Hi, this is Doug Wrench, and today we're going to be looking at a vintage midget racing car. And although we've identified what car it is, we don't know the color scheme because we only have black and white photos. So what we do have, though, is a couple pieces of the original bodywork that we've ground through. And we have our color expert, Tanya Wrench, here, who's going to look at the color at the panels and at the bullseyes. And she's going to tell us what the colors are from the very first color up until when it was obviously painted red, as you see it here. So, Tanya, why don't you tell us what you see? Where do you want to All right, we'll start, start with this piece. And um, if you look really carefully, there's some black edging in here, but right Where does beyond... it start? Right by the silver, though. When you okay, first by go. the silver. Um, there's some green primer, which is um, similar to... To the primer on one of these other pieces. Yeah, that would have been the zinc chromate primer that went on the bare aluminum. And right beyond there, it looks like it was painted like a bright orangey red. Um, and you can see that all, all through this entire area that we rubbed down. This is a much different color than, than the red that's currently on the piece. Uh, so we know it had that color. Well, tell us what you uh, see from every color out, like tree rays. Yeah, yeah. and beyond so that, the there's a... One, two. Yeah, right right next to the um, primer green is a, a slaty gray-blue color. Um, and it looks... It may have had some iridescence to it, may not have, I don't know. I mean, it looks pretty... It looks like a pretty flat, but it's a... It's a really pretty uh, gray-blue um, beyond that, uh, we see the, uh, the start of this orange, uh, reddish orange to a really pretty bright orange. Um, and then we see a really pretty, like a mocha chocolate coffee color right in through here. And there's additional on this other, uh, this, on this other piece you see even more so. Um, actually this is a better piece to look at. Um, you can see the cocoa color, like mocha. Um, and then there's this gorgeous maroon, which has quite a bit of iridescence to it. So I don't know if that, that must have come maybe right after the orange. And again, it looked like they painted the, color, the car again, a kind of a gray color, a smoky gray. Which could have been a primer. Yeah, which could have been a primer. Um, but this is a really beautiful black cherry, iridescent black cherry in, in here. So um, I, I don't know if it was the whole car. Or it was just portions of like fenders or something painted. But this mocha, this chocolate color, looks pretty significant in a large area. And then it went into this orangey color again. And we actually do have some purple. It looked like maybe an orange black and purple scheme to it and again back to black which is just could be just accent this maroon could have been like pinstriping or something uh, on, on the cocoa um, there's also this color which is almost like a like a cream I don't know it, it, it's more like a, a, a skin tone color so I don't know where that plays into the thing um, but the, it, the car obviously had been painted and repainted in all sorts of, all sorts of color schemes. Probably, probably according to whatever, um, whatever was fashionable during um, during that time period when these cars were were run. You know, well, or maybe some... when they per when they got repurchased by another owner. Well, here you can see too that there is that brown again on a different section with a blue now. Yeah. Oh, this. Yeah, this blue is a gorgeous. Um, iridescent blue. I mean, I, I don't know if you can pick it up on the camera, but it has got, it is really sparkling. And this is, this is a better, um, larger piece of the brown. And again, here's another piece of a different type of brown, which almost looks like a mauvey brown. So that could have been, um, that could have been another accent color that they used in the, uh, you know, in the in the car, but you know, right now it's this red. We're going to try to strip it down and see what exactly. There's layers. Here's some here's some of that cream, and that probably because it's sitting right next to the brown here. That was probably the cream color 
that was painted with this brown, which is this brown, which is that other brown that we saw over here. So you could, um, it, you could, you could see the different colors here. Some of that blue, you can see right in, in, in the cracks. That's the same blue as this iridescent blue. Um, well, Tanya, well, baby, you get a chunk. You can actually probably chunk it out and and. Um, well, in our next them. video, we have some uh, black and white photographs, so maybe we can look at those black and white photographs and see we can see the way the colors perhaps make sense. All right, so this is video number one. We'll see you next time on video two.